welcome to Tech with D. Uh, today we will be making a musical song. So please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification button and please drop a like on the video. So I will show you a sample of the musical circuit that I have made before. It's like this. It has three popsicle sticks, a switch, battery holder. You will need a cup, a circuit board. I used a buzzer for la at last. So today I'm going to make it with the speaker. So the components you need are a speaker, three popsicle sticks, a BC547 transistor, a UM66 IC, uh, a switch, 220 ohm resistor, few wires, and some soldering wires. With two AA batteries and a battery holder. So let's get building the circuit. Sorry, I have to include the circuit board. Let's build the circuit first. Please keep your soldering irons on if you are going to make this. So, before moving on, this is the diagram. If you want, you can copy it. This is the IC. This is the speaker. The resistor. The transistor. And the batteries. This is the positive side of the battery, which goes to the VCC of the IC. I will explain the parts of the IC. And the other part goes to the ground. So I will keep it for a while. So now I will go with the IC and the transistor. Uh, the UM66 IC has three pins. From the flat side, if we take the left, it's ground. The middle is VCC, and the right is out. If we take the transistor BC547, from the flat side, the left is collector, middle is base, and the right is emitter. So. The transistor and the IC look same uh, by the name on the flat side you can identify the parts. So first I will say the UM66 IC. So I am going to insert it from the dull side and solder it from the shiny side. So I am taking it to a certain level. If you want, you can put it all the way. So we will keep it to dry off and cool it, cool down. Because you can't touch it so and the transistor will connect to it right here. emitter pin is the emitter pin is near to the ground pin 
so when we are soldering we have to connect those both of them so the next step is these two pins should connect the ground of the um66 and the emitter of the bc5% transistor so i'm going to solder it because it's close enough as you can see I connected both of them together Next, I'm going to connect the resistor. It's a 220 ohm resistor. The color code is red, red, brown, and gold. So it should connect to the base of the BC547 and the out pin of the IC, UM66 IC. So I'm going to bend it. Now I'm going to sort it. One pin is connected and I'm going to connect the other pin to the out pin of the uh, IC. So I have soldered it here. I have to wait it until it cools down. So next, I will take the speaker and connect two wires I will connect two wires to both of the pins there are no negative and positive for them you can find these speakers in toy cars or toys that have sound <laughs> speakers one wire to the middle pin of the IC so before that I'll uh, solder some wires to the switch so it will be easy Now 
while connect the the wires of the speaker to the board. This pin should go uh, this wire of the speaker that is remaining should go to the collector of the transistor so I am going to take this wire and keep it right here them now uh, one pin or one wire of the speaker can go anywhere in the board but do not connect it to any pin so, now I'll have to connect one the pin that is not connect the wire that is not connected to any pin that means the middle pin or the VCC of the IC. So I'm going to take a small piece of wire for that. As you can see, I have soldered one wire. Here. Yeah. So all the pins are connected to any the resistor is connected to one pin of the IC and one pin of the transistor that means from the transistor it's the base pin and from the IC it's the output pin and the uh, ground pin and the emitter pin should connect uh, together and the last that was collecting the pin of of the IC that means the VCC to the speaker so yeah. now uh, we'll connect the battery pack and let's see to it so, I'm going to solder it. And we need another one wire so we could connect it to the negative wire of the battery pack. So I'm going to peel. I'm going to twist it. Uh, now I'm going to connect it to the wire. the battery pack should go where we have connected the ground pin and the emitter pin of the transistor ground pin of the ice so I'm going to connect it there the negative pin negative wire <laughs> the 
positive wire should go to the where I have to peel the wire first. have to connect the positive pin or the wire that we have connected to the switch um, to where we have connected the speakers wire and as we could say to the VCC pin and the wire that we connected from the speaker it goes here Check this. I will take my two batteries. I think you can hear it. from the switch it will off when I on it as you can see it works that way so I am going to build the structure of for the musical circuit so My hot glue gun is heated, so I'm going to make the popsicle stick structure. You need a cup, a uh, craft knife for a paper cutter. Or you can use a blade. So first I will put some hot glue in the middle. Then I'll paste it like this. I hope you can see. I'll wait it to dry. So this is dried. I took a wooden cube for this. If you can see. So I'm going to paste it right next to the green cube. Green popsicle stick. So as you can see this is the way this is the base of the structure so apply glue to the side and paste the third popsicle stick here like this Take my cup. Uh, I will take measurement for this. I am going to take a small measurement for this. See if it fits. 
it fits perfectly so now i have to make a small hole for the speaker So I'm going to cut it uh, a bit smaller than it is that uh, the way I have gone. It would be like this but it doesn't matter for that. Uh, if you want you can like paste it from inside but I'm pasting it from the out I'm keeping small dots I guess I don't want uh, a lot to be pasted so if the speaker is damaged I can replace it easily if there are holes fill it with the hot glue so I'm going to let it for it to dry now I'm going to paste the circuit somewhere here I could paste it so you have to choose so now I'll have to keep it to dry want you can arrange the wires because I don't have to arrange the wires I am going to keep it like this put in the cup in put some glue under and from inside so I'll have to wait it to dry if it keeps tilting like that uh, put some more glue ready to try I am going to paste this here or you can paste this battery holder so it does not fall so now it's steady <laughs> <laughs> 